Okay, I think I got the meter now. It's really interesting the way that the cadence changes. And I'm going to try and replicate it with my American accent. But I'm using older Greek, and I'll tell you why I'm doing that. It helps you understand what they were doing. See, all languages start with short vowels. E, E is ace. The trouble is, I learned it as ice for four years. So it's a hard habit for me to break. So when you hear me say ice, I'm dead wrong. It's e, 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 e. You can see how modern Greek came to exist. E, e. They would have pronounced the short vowels distinctly. And then in speech, they'd use diphthongs and stuff, which of course this is. And they'd run it together. E, 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 e. You see how that came about? All right. So this should be ace. That's how I should be pronouncing it. But I screw it up. So if I screw it up, then you'll know why. All right? All vowels are short in ancient languages. The first version of all vowels in all ancient languages are short. They only become long due to, you know, the mixture of usage when in speech. Long vowels came later. All right? So we want to make sure to preserve, we want to go back to the older language. It'll be closer to short vowels. Okay. So we'll start here. Okay. A swill te sien. We'll start over. A swill te sien. Di Jesu Christu. A serpido zazan di san estaseos. Jesu Christu at necrom. A saton kata. Ten y do kian. Tu telemotos autu. A serpido zazan di anestaseos. Jesu Christu at necrom. Escleronomian aftar ton, camian ton, camaran ton, tetremenen en uranes es humas, e se paenon toxis es haritos auto, es haritosen, es haritosen cremas, en tragamenoi, en noecomen, ten apolutrosen, tie tu jamatos auto, Tena pesin, a escleronomia, nartarton, camianton, camaranton, tetremenen, en uranes es humas, tena polutrosen, dietu jamatos autu, tena pesin. That's the syncopation. Okay? See, in the first time, we're going 105. To 120. So we're inserting Peter's equivalent phrase that goes through 120 here between 105 and the Pauline start. Okay? And then we read the Pauline that takes you also to 120. Okay? But then this gets reinserted again because of this, this um, what do you want to call it? Time bridge. You know, church is time bridge to Israel, and it's the 140 years, the doubling of the rebuilding of the temple. It's very cute. Okay? Imagine, you know, you're doing this little marching song, and you're remembering all these things while you do it. It's very evocative, very helpful for the troops, which is any Christian soldier, you know, any Christian person. All right? So, first time, it, the the... Petrine passage gets inserted right here. Second time, it gets inserted right here. Okay? And you can argue a third time it could get inserted right here. But I'm going to leave that out this time just to see what the what results. Alright? So we start again. A sweet de sien di Jesu Christu. I still Peter Zosan di Anastasius Jesu Christu at Necrom. A Saton Kata ten you do kyan. Tu telemetros autu, e serpitos osan di anestesis, Jesu Christu et pecron. E scleronomian aftar ton, camian ton, camaran ton, tetremenen en uranes es humas, e sopainon toxis es haritos autu, e scaritos en emas, e scaritos en emas, en toa En toyapamen noi, en noi echomen, ten apolutrosen, tietu jamatos autu, ten afesin. 
Escleronomia, Aftarton, Camianton, Camaranton, Tetrumenen, en urales es como más, ten apolutros en, die tu hamatos auto, ten afesin. You see, because the second time, Escleronomian Aftarton is running from 123 to 169. Okay, so you got to pick it up at 151 and run it out. Okay, so you pick it here up here at 151. Okay, and you insert it between You insert it again the second time, and so you end up with Camaran ton, tetteremenen, tetteremenen, enura, tetteremenen, tetteremenen, en uranesis, en uranesis humas, and then ten napolutros en, dieto jaimatos auto, ten efesi. Okay, maybe I should do it one more time. If you, it, the thing that, that's real key about this is that once you start the rhythm, it ends up changing its cadence based on what went before. And what's so clever about that is that we were, Peter's playing on Paul's anaphora right here. Here's your first anaphora, repeated three times in the passage. Here's your second anaphora. And then the third out of four, Temple Trio, comes later in the Pauline passage. But, you know, obviously Peter knew that because he's wrapping a song around the anaphora. And anaphora is a repetition of three. Okay. And that's what he's doing here. So he's repeating it wrapped around the anaphora, starting it at and wrapping it around the anaphora. So it's got an anaphora within an anaphora within an anaphora, turning it into a song. Is that cool or what? Okay, so we'll start from the top. A square te sian, di Jesu Christu, ais el pideso san di anstasias Jesu Christu et necron, es auton kata ten yuto kian, tu telematos auto, es el pideso san di anstasias Jesu Christu et necron. Escleronomian aftar ton, camian ton, camaran ton, tetremenen, en uranes es comas, en nipa es epaenon, toxis es haritos autu, es haritos en gemas, en toe agapemen, no en noe ecomen, ten apolutros en, tia tu jamatos autu, ten a feisin, Escleronomian, aftarton, camianton, camaranton, tetremenen, en urales es humas, ten apolutrosen, dietu jamatos autu, ten afesin. Thank you. Sorry, I didn't read it better. I'll have to practice it a hundred times. Peace out. Okay, now I want to show you some other things about how clever Peter's insertions are. I, it just blows me away when I think about it. He's he's tied to the grammar. Again, anybody who thinks Peter didn't know Greek very well, they don't know Peter's writing very well. Is all I can say. Okay. Es huiotisian di Jesu Christu. That's an ace clause. All right. So he ties it with another ace clause. Es serpentosan di anastasios Jesu Christu et necron. We know he's tagging the Paul. I mean, it's, not, it's, it's a no-brainer here. Look, same exact phrase as Paul begins as, you know, Ephesians 1.3. You'd be immediately reminded of that if you'd memorized the text. Okay? All right? And Paul's doing ace bullets. All right? These are like little bullet points. If you had a pre PPS presentation in Word. Okay? See, he's tracking the prepositions. That's why I parsed the clauses that way. Yeah, and Peter's tracking them the same way. Okay? So let's do that again so you see the point. Es huiotesian di Jesu Christu 
Eesis on Peter's son, the Anastasius, Jesus Christ, the Kron. So he's taking this Ace clause and he's sandwiching it between this Ace clause and Paul and this Ace clause and Paul. So the next thing you logically read would be, okay, Ace Saton Kata, Ten Yudo Kyan, and of course it matches in syllables too. To Telematos Altu, Ace Sapitus Osan, the Anastasius, Jesus Christ, at Necron. See, they're all ace clauses. This is just, it's so awesome, I want to kill myself. Because when I was doing Ephesians, I had a lot of doubts about the adequacy or the correctness of what I was doing. I was going strictly by cadence and sound. All right? And I thought, well, gee, how do I prove that what I did here was right? And then, you know, the other day, here's Peter, and he's doing the same thing. Okay, it's really clever. It just drives me crazy that I know this. I wish the world knew it. That's why I'm making the video. Okay, so we got a squio tesian di Jesu Christu, a serpides osan di anestaseus Jesu Christu at necron, a sauton kata ten yuto kian tu telematos autu, a serpides osan di anestaseus Jesu Christu at necron. And now he inserts another ice claw, ace clause before he does the next Paul clause. Okay, and it's still keeping with the ace bullets. All right, ace cleronomian, astar ton, camian ton, camaran ton, tetremenen, and uranis is humas, ace painon. See, now he ties the ball. Dosis is haritos auto. See? Doxis is Haritos Auto is matched in its pattern and its cadence with Enuranas is Humas. Esepainon Doxis is Haritos Auto. Let me go through that again so you can see. He's matching cadence. He's creating a matching cadence. Because in Paul's original, by itself, he has a, a slightly different cadence. All right? But Peter's turning the whole thing into a marching song. I'm sorry, but Peter really knew his Greek, honey. The proof is right in front of your eyes. Okay? So let's start with the second stanza again with Peter's meter. Okay? Eskleron nomiyan, aftar ton, kamyan ton, kamaran ton, tetremenen, es uranos es humas, Eispainon, doxis is haritos auto, is haritos en imas, en to agapeme noe, en noe ecome, ten apolutos en, dia tu haimatos auto, ten afesin. See, he's doing three of these clauses with the same, he's syncopated. Okay, change. En noranes is homas, eispainon. See, so he goes back to the root, the root cadence, but he inserts this in it. And Nuranes is Humas, a sepainon, and it makes perfect sense. In heaven, for you, for the praise of his glory, for his praise. i got to turn this into English, but I haven't done it yet. And then he comes back repeating this cadence. And Nuranes is Humas. Toxis is haritos auto. See, it's the same cadence. Es haritos en hermas. Es haritos en hermas. I have trouble saying this. Es haritos en hermas. You kind of allied the E here. It's just a breath. Es haritos en hermas. Doxis es haritos auto. Es haritos en hermas. They've all got the same cadence. They're alternating cadence. And they've got the same cadence amongst each other. Is that cool or what? And he's keeping to the ice bullets. Oh, no.
nuts. Um, sorry, I hate it when this happens. Um, I hit the wrong button on the, the menu. All right. So he's matching endurones his gumas. Toxis is caritus auto. Dear to hamatos auto. See, they've all got the same cadence. See, this is something you got to almost say aloud. That's why I want to go back to the old pronunciation for this stuff. If you say it aloud, you can get the cadence and see if the words flow together. That's why I'm doing it. All right? All right, so now we'll, we'll do the whole thing again. Now that you see, see, it's interleaved, and the cadence is interleaved, too. It shifts. The cadence shifts because they're talking back and forth to each other. That's the same kind of style that you see in the Hebrew since Moses, Psalm 90. It just it just kills me. I don't know how this has slept. This text has been out in the open for 2,000 years and we don't know about it. it drives me nuts. Okay, we'll start over. A suyo te siyan, di Jesu Christu, e serpido zosan di anastasias Jesu Christu et necron. Esa tom kata ten you do kyan tu telematos autu see tu telematos autu toxis is haritos autu and urano is is kumas dia tu kaimatos autu right here see and this cute Okay, sorry, I'll start over again. E suyo te sien, di Jesu Christu, e serpide zosan di Anastasios Jesu Christu et necron. E saton kata ten judo kian tu telematos autu, e serpide zosan di Anastasios Jesu Christu et necron. E skloron omian aftar ton, kamian ton. Camaran ton tetremenen en uranes is gumas e se painon doxis is haritos autu es haritos en gemas en en tagapamen noi en noi ecomen ten apolutrusen tia tu haimatos autu ten afeisin e se clero es cleron nomian aftar ton Camian ton, camaran ton, tetremenen, en uranes is humas, ten apolutrusen, dia tu hematos autu, ten afesin. It's a beautiful what? Great marching song. Peace out.